Hey guys, welcome back to NextGen Block. Uh, and in this video, I want to show you how you can create a bounce effect in VSCC Free Video Editor. Now, it's actually super easy to create a bounce effect in VSCC. So, without further delay, let's get started and see how you can do this. Now, to demonstrate this, I've already imported a demo video in the editor. So, this is my demo video present right here. And the first thing which you need to do to create a bounce effect is double click on the video. Next, go to video effects, go to transforms, select crop and then click on OK. Now currently the duration of the crop effect is the entire duration of my demo video, which is 9 seconds to 66 milliseconds. So I would like to reduce the duration of my crop effect to just 500 milliseconds. So inside the duration option, you need to write 00, 00.500 and then press enter. Now, currently my crop effect is placed at zero seconds in the timeline. So I would like to place it at one second. So inside the time option, you need to write 0, 01.000 and then press enter. Now look inside the crop effect settings which is present inside the properties window and you will find this option called cropped borders. Inside this option you will find four additional options left, top, right and bottom. So first of all you need to change this from constant parameter value to linear parameter change so that you get two values to fill. And now look inside the left option. Inside the left option, currently the values are 0 semicolon 0. So you need to change the values from 0 semicolon 0 to 0 semicolon 25. Similarly, inside the top option, currently the values are 0 semicolon 0. So change the values from 0 semicolon 0 to 0 semicolon 25. Inside the right option, currently the values are 100 semicolon 100. So instead of 100 semicolon 100, you need to write 100 semicolon 50 and then press enter. Similarly, inside the bottom option, the values are 100 semicolon 100. So instead of 100 semicolon 100, write the values 100 semicolon 50 and then press enter. Perfect. Now, if I just quickly play the video for you. Perfect. Next, what you need to do is you need to create a duplicate from this crop effect. So click on this crop effect, press Ctrl C to copy it and then press Ctrl V to paste a duplicate. Now place this second crop effect right after the first crop effect like this and click on this second crop effect and look inside the crop effect settings. Look inside the cropped borders option and inside the left option Currently, the values are 0 semicolon 25. So you need to simply reverse the values. So instead of 0 semicolon 25, write 25 semicolon 0. Similarly, inside the top option, instead of 0 semicolon 25, write 25 semicolon 0. Inside the right option, currently the values are 100 semicolon 50. So reverse the values. Instead of 100 semicolon 50, write 50 semicolon 100. Similarly, inside the bottom option, currently the values are 100 semicolon 50. So instead of 100 semicolon 50, write 50 semicolon 100 and then press enter. Perfect. And that's it. So now if I just quickly play the video for you. Perfect. So this is how you can create a bounce effect. Now you can customize this bounce effect even more by adjusting the duration of the crop effect. So currently both my crop effect is of 500 milliseconds duration, which means in total it is a one second effect, but you can increase it as well as decrease it according to your need. Um, what I would like to do is I would like to select these two crop effects, press Ctrl C to copy them and then press Ctrl V to paste duplicates, two additional duplicates. Now place these duplicates 
a little further in the timeline and so that there is some distance between my first two crop effects and my third and fourth crop effect and so now if I just quickly play the video for you perfect so this is how you can create a bounce effect in VSTC free video editor do let me know your thoughts in the coming section below like the video and subscribe to my youtube channel i will again see you in the next video till then thanks for watching